the story of survival and revival. Soren Chiring Lepcha is an architect, restorer, and renovator of Lepcha music, language, and culture. A man whose heart is always filled with a love for the culture, folklore, and Lepcha song and music. His dream and endeavor of life concerns solely for the betterment of his community. <laughs> It is who trod the long painstaking way of exploring the value, richness, and depth of the culture of Lepcha that had been waiting for a visionary since antiquity. The present status of Lepchas in the state, national, and world community, and possibility and aspiration would be in shambles had it not been due to the tireless and exploratory works of Sonam Chiring Lepcha. He was born on the lap of Nimje Chiring Lepcha and Nurmu Lepcha on 3rd January 1928 at Bom Kyung, a small village of Kalimpong. Sonam had a very special attachment with his grandmother where he learned many things from her when he was just nine years boy. Being a second son in the family after the mother death and his elder brother also joined the army during the Second World War, he had to do lots of house chores and look after siblings. Despite of grim situation of family, Sonam did not lose his heart. He gave his heart, soul, mind and body for the preservation of Lepcha song, music and culture. His contribution towards Lepcha culture started fully from 1947 and gradually revival of Lepcha culture took place in different areas of Darjeeling Hills. He became a household name in every Lepcha village and they called him Ro Lepun. He successfully brought the unseen, unknown Lepcha folk songs and dance among the wider audience. He taught Lepcha instruments to the young Lepcha men and women in villages and made a history in 1960 by being the first Lepcha songs to be heard on All India Radio. He was a man behind the Lepcha national anthem, Rung Dungit Vum. He was the main person in the history of celebrating the birth anniversary of great Lepcha leader, King Gibu Acho. He also came forward to motivate people for the celebration of the 51 birth anniversary in 20th December. 
He recalled those days, the days of struggle with his own people. Some of the prominent Lepcha leaders during those days tried to stuff him to organize the birth anniversary of great leader. But later days, gradually they understood the value. And since 1986, Lepcha Shejung took over this venture and is continually going on without any halt. Today, huge celebration of King Gibu Achuk's birth anniversary is organized in a grand manner at Mela Ground, Kalimpong. During late 70s, Sejums were in verge of dying stage due to political pressure and lack of leadership. In this grey situation, Sonam started Nayung Fat, a cultural group, in 1978 AD to revive Lepcha people. He gave classroom teachings to resurrect Lepcha language and music in different places of Darjeeling and brought a sense of belongingness and awakening among the Lepcha communities. He started to collect antique pieces of material associated with Lepchas since the Stenishes of Lepcha tribe. During his visits to the villages, some elderly person came forward to offer Sonam Chiring Lepcha some items with grateful heart. In some places, he intentionally asked the people and they also offered as a gift to Lapan. This was the beginning of the history of Lepcha Museum. Gradually, it became a place of attraction for the people. Slowly, Lepcha Museum came to exist in the upper room of Lepcha Hostel.
Ve bunları gomurata no misi yare, ne jam sama no misi yare, kaysa lakat ni gom ne kaysa, nung pion som shumba yang sakjing mare. Anda reak jom na shushu tumpu jom, kendo tun de vet na, shimana are on wa tun vet mare, un bukina gonadi, di kate ngum bambu, ana dangat ramatun, di kate ngum bambu. Mana are kate ngka sia dona. Saya dorong saya jatuh ini kampung di mana saya pun, anda le jap sura sun pido bol bol tu jatuh. Karena hari ini anda guna di bawah saya le, tuh sambil som sumba, som la som som show, tuh saya gitu nanom sumba tuh di bawah saya di mana guna cing nari hari ini jom jom jom, anda dong tak nanti jom jom. awards for his music. His contribution to the preservation of Lepcha culture had been acknowledged by the government of India in 1996 and awarded him India's highest folk music award, Sangeet Natak Academy, then followed by India's highest prestigious award, Padma Shri, in 2007. Tegur Ratna, 2012, and Banga Bivushi. His passion for the Lecha culture is not ended with this limited activity. He wants to take Lecha culture, song, and music to the great height. His bleeding heart is always saying that more work is to be done for the Lechas. At the age of 89 also, he never gives up the work for the Lechas tribe. He wants to see Lechas Museum as the center for learning to all people around the world. He shared his concept to other colleagues and authorities, but was not highly appreciated. Yet, he never gave up his heart. At last, his well-wishers, family and friends suggested him to form a registered body to take the revenue war to the highest level. Sonam Shirin Devcha Cultural and Heritage Development Society is the result of his hard work. This registered body is committed to work for the cause of the lecture. The governing body is contented to work alongside with Lupin Sanam Chirin lecture, taking his vision and aspiration side by side. Although there are lots of challenges and more works to be done in days to come, but the governing body of Sunan Chiring Lepcha Cultural and Heritage Development Society is ready to face all such challenges. <laughs> Some of the challenges as well as objectives are a suitable space is needed for showcasing all the materials in systematic way. Maintain high standards of professionalism and technical rigor. Authentication of materials, certification by the archaeological department or relevant agency. Affiliation to the other anthropological museum. Resource mobilization, fundraising campaign, 
and human resources. Linkages to tourism of the hills, especially CBT, community-based tourism. Connection with wider audience through website. Center for learning for students about Lepcha culture, music and songs. Capacity building training for staffs, STLCHDS. Working with like-minded partners. To be applied ETG 12A tax deductible if needed FCRA etc.